That could be huge. Uh, just how widespread is this practice of getting dental work made overseas? We don't know. But as of right now, there are currently four cases in the country of patients being afflicted with lead poisoning. Today, we talked with local experts about what this means for you. Well, this has been going on for many years, but uh, nobody knows, and it's just now coming to light. The owner of the Black Diamond more Dental more Studio more. is talking about a recent alert about an Ohio woman who had an adverse reaction to her dental bridge. The bridge contained lead in the porcelain unit. It was made in China. Now the National Association of Dental Laboratories and the American Dental Association are warning its members. There is no room in the mouth for anything that contains lead. The fear is that there could be more crowns out there with lead, because as of right now, only three states regulate dental labs as to where they get their material from. Colorado is not one of them. Black Diamond says it stands behind all of its work, that their products are FDA approved, but other labs may look overseas to cut costs. A broker could go in there, not owning a dental lab, but just having a name of a dental lab and take that impression and send it overseas. And the doctor would never know whether that crown came from China, India, or Mexico, or wherever. And not only that, the worst part is the patient will never know. What can a person do to make sure their crowns are safe? Ask a lot of questions. Dentist Jeffrey Hurst says his crowns are made here in Colorado, and his lab certifies and lists all materials. Every patient should and does have the right to ask their dentist, what is this crown made out of? Where is it being made? 